Hey everybody, how's it going? It's Paul, I'm with the Dicey Review, and I'm here today to talk about The Cupid Crisis, which is uh, a game from Grand Gamers Guild that's coming out uh, that's perfectly themed for um, for Valentine's Day. And, and Mark reached out and asked if I would be willing to make a video for it, and absolutely I am. I'm totally happy to make a video, but I'm kind of torn, honestly. Like, whenever I make videos about these type of, like, theme games that have a really strong theme with, like, a particular holiday or something like that, I like to ask one of my friends to come and talk a little bit about the game, but... I don't know, I'm, I'm just kind of torn this time. I don't know why. I mean, I have a lot of different choices. You know, I could go with my friend Jacques. Oh, hello, you should certainly let me talk about the game for I am the master of love. Ken the wizard wouldn't be a terrible choice. You should let me talk about the game. I'm an expert on all things romance. Why, I could even make a love potion that definitely might not, probably won't explode. I don't know, I, I think the reason that I'm torn is because the perfect choice, the obvious choice, would be my friend Cupid. But to be completely honest, to be completely just transparent, the guy drives me crazy. His voice, the high, just annoying, grinding, grating voice, I don't know, maybe maybe I'm being unfair, but I just don't really think that it's, that it's a great solution, you know? I mean, um, I don't know, maybe I'll give him a chance, but I... <laughs> <sighs> Oh, good. Did that blowhard finally stop talking? <laughs> uh, don't worry about it. It was just a sleep dart. He'll wake up, probably. What's really more important is to talk about the new game, The Cupid Crisis, from Grand Gamers Guild. Now, as you can tell, I'm Cupid and definitely not Paul in a costume. Now, we have really important things to discuss, so we need to move away from the possible crime that I just committed and talk about The Cupid Crisis. The Cupid Crisis is a new escape room card game just in time for Valentine's Day. And I know what you're thinking. Cupid, I have Valentine's Day all figured out. I'm going to get chocolates and roses and candy and all the normal things. And while I agree that those are great choices, they're also old-fashioned and terrible choices. What you should really get for Valentine's Day is a wonderful shared gaming experience like, I don't know, a game named after me. You see, The Cupid Crisis is great, not just because it's a fun game, but also because it makes your brain work and gives you all those nice, wonderful feels of solving puzzles. The Cupid Crisis is wonderful for groups of any age. It's super straightforward, doesn't require you to download an app, but still provides app-like support by visiting the website listed here. You and your friends can have a wonderful time trying to solve different Valentine's-themed puzzles. If you're a fan of escape rooms or riddles or puzzles like that, this game is going to be right up your alley. And the website tracks everything, including your scores, giving you hints, giving you all kinds of different information that you might need, and it keeps track of your time and gives you a rating at the end based on how quickly you finished and how many clues you had to use to figure out all of those tricky puzzles. So take it from me, actually Cupid and not Paul, for this Valentine's Day, ditch the flowers and the candy and all the typical type stuff and buy The Cupid Crisis from Grand Gamers Guild by visiting this website. It's a great creative way to have a fun date on Valentine's Day, and more importantly, it's got my name on it! <laughs>